we can see a rocket being LAUNHED. We often hear the words and acceleration and velocity. Launching a rocket involves acceleration and velocity. In this video we are going Definition of acceleration The common use of the word acceleration gives about moving or increasing with high speed. But the actual meaning is the change of speed, i.e., change of velocity, by increasing or decreasing the speed. The rate of change of velocity is acceleration. As we have seen before, velocity is said to be the speed with direction. In other words, when there is a change in velocity, consequently the acceleration exists. For example, consider a pebble is dropped into the water. When the pebble is dropped, its initial speed is zero. When it hits the water, its speed increases due to Earth's gravity. So the water splashes up. Therefore acceleration is defined as the rate of change of velocity. If the velocity of a body is changed from u to v in time t, then acceleration is given as follows. Acceleration equals change in velocity, time taken equals final velocity, initial velocity, time taken a equals d, u v, dt as it has both magnitude and direction, it is a vector quantity. SI unit of acceleration is meter per square second or ms2. Definition of velocity The rate of change of displacement is velocity. When an object is moving in a specific direction with respect to time is said to be velocity, i.e., the quantity that specifies both distance and time is called velocity. The velocity of an object can be changed by changing the speed, direction or both of that object. In other words, it is defined as the displacement produced per unit time. Velocity equals displacement, time equals x, t where x is the distance traveled in a given direction, i.e., displacement. It is calculated as the difference between the positions. X equals final point, initial point equals V, UT, time taken to travel the distance. V equals D, T velocity V is calculated as the change in displacement with respect to time. It is a vector quantity as it is dependent on both magnitude and direction. For example, traveling in a car at a speed of 20 meters per second towards the north in 2 minutes, this explains that the car moved with what speed, in what direction and time took for this displacement. Hence, velocity is a vector quantity. Vector quantity involves not just the magnitude but also the direction, i.e. two-dimensional. SI unit of velocity is meter per second or ms1. Difference between velocity and acceleration Velocity acceleration velocity is the rate of change of displacement. Acceleration is the rate of change of velocity. Velocity is a vector quantity because it consists of both magnitude and direction. Acceleration is also a vector quantity as it is just the rate of change of velocity. As velocity is a vector quantity, obviously, acceleration is also. Velocity may be positive or negative as zero. Acceleration may be positive or negative. It cannot be zero as it is defined as the change in velocity or speed. This explains that there should be some motion for acceleration. SI unit is meter per second or ms1. SI unit is meter per square second or ms2. Formula for velocity equals displacement, time formula for acceleration equals velocity, time these are the differences between velocity and acceleration.